Logistics management is an important aspect of supply chain management that is used to meet customer demands through planning, control and the movement of products and information in the supply chain. The potential introduction of customs arrangements associated with Brexit is likely to have a significant impact on logistics management for manufacturers in Northern Ireland, with those in the agri-food sector particularly at risk. Let's consider some of the actions you can take to reduce the impact of Brexit if you move products along the cross-border transit routes between Northern Ireland and Great Britain, Northern Ireland and the Republic of Ireland, and Northern Ireland to the EU mainland. Firstly, you can apply for an authorised economic operator certification, and also apply for an economic operator registration identification number to reduce some of the logistics problems at the border. You can also use transitional simplified procedures to declare your goods to customs, which allows you to defer making a full declaration and paying customs duties until after the products arrive in Northern Ireland. You can use the Common Transit Convention to pay duty when your products reach their final destination, and this may allow customs procedures to be carried out away from the border. You should also consider using INCO terms in your shipping processes. These are a global standard contract defining clearly who is responsible for each part of a shipment's journey when products are being imported or exported. There are a number of additional strategies you can consider for dealing with logistics difficulties, including establishing new distribution routes, holding inventory closer to target markets, air freighting products where it is cost effective, and engaging closely with hauliers, customs brokers, and key customers and suppliers. Use the resources to identify actions you can take to minimise disruptions to your logistics network, which will help you to control the economic costs to your firm and customers.